What's going on ladies and gentlemen of my channel? This is the RGB mouse pad that I ordered for my setup. As you guys can tell, my motherboard is in the left hand corner. I'm not gonna put it together until I am able to get my RAM. So you guys already took a sneak peek. <laughs> so let's go ahead and take off the covering. Wow, all right. So I didn't want to go with Corsair because you know, I wanted something RGB, something cheap also for a mouse pad. So it's a GMS X5 gaming mouse pad. You guys can see it has like RGB on the outside, USB power red, plug and play, 14 mode spectrum, black lighting, seven colors. So it looks pretty cool. I like it. All right. I've never had a like big gaming mouse pad before, so this is my first one. My old mouse pad is just is just a regular one. Hold up. All right, there we go. Let's go ahead and open it up. All right, so we can take this and put it away, cast it to the side. It said it might come a little bit folded up, so to put heavy things on it, we're in the instructions to make sure that it unfolds properly. Holy guacamole, guys. This thing is massive. I can't even get it here in one shot. It's big enough for a keyboard as well as a uh, <laughs> gaming mouse. Holy cow. Look at this thing. Holy cow. It's super long. So you guys, to give you guys a perspective of how massive this uh, gaming mouse pad is, we'll go ahead and get like an aerial shot. So let's let's do this. You see my lamp right here. Sorry, let's move you out of the way. There's like some little instructions that it came with. All right, but yeah, to give you guys a little perspective, that's my gaming PC right there, and this is like this is how long it is. This is crazy. So it's gonna fit my gaming keyboard as well as my mouse right there, and I just feel like it'd be super awesome. I feel like this would fit really well with the matte black and white theme that I'm going with for this setup, as well as the RGB inside the keyboard and the mouse that I'm also buying. So let's go ahead and get this thing plugged in and see what it looks like. So here's the cable for this mouse pad. Let's see. Yeah, it uses the Android style, the old Android style. <laughs> Holy moly. All right. So this is pretty long, which is actually great because that way I'd uh, be able to go underneath the table so you guys wouldn't have to see this. But for now, we're just going to plug it into my lamp because my lamp has USB and we're going to see if it works. Struggle with untangling this. Okay. So yeah, there's USB. Let's go ahead and plug that in. My lamp, and we'll plug it into the flow pad. This is crazy. All right. I mean, it looks pretty cool, and it feels all right. I mean, other than like a few of these uh, little spots where it's sticking up, but I'll just put some heavy things on it, like it said in the instructions. All right. So you guys can see the uh, USB hole right there. So I'm going to connect it. See, that's the right way, right? Yeah. Okay. There we go. Whoa, look at that. We have life. We have life. Holy cow. All right, so right now you can see it's colored all around, like all around here. It's a little bit more difficult to see these because my light's on. If you guys hear that in the background, that's my AC unit. Sorry, it's just super hot. Yeah, all right. And it's daylight, so you can see the blue. It's obviously going to be most bright right there by the power source. I think we can change the color schematics too. Right now, it's just ongoing. So let's go ahead. If we click it once, it becomes red. If we click it another time, it's blue. Oh, I like the blue. I don't know if you guys can see that, but I really like the blue. All right, then it becomes green, purple. This is like a blue white. And then yellow and then white so I really like this mouse pad I'm super happy that I got it I'm gonna go ahead and put my current setup with this and see how it looks and I'll be right back with y'all as soon as I do that this is what it's looking like so far you guys can tell I have a window right here so it's letting a lot of light in so it's not as good right here but you guys can see the RGB this is how I'm going to use my setup for now. You guys can clearly see any reflection from my surface. But until I get my monitor, this is how I'm going to be playing video games. And it just works wonders. It's super huge. And I have a giant area for my mouse, which works out perfectly. 
but as soon as I'm able to get a monitor right here and then get a glorious model D mouse that'll connect to my PC, then my keyboard will go right here. And I think I'm getting a like Red Dragon Iro. It's gonna be a white RGB keyboard with um, uh, rests for your wrist. That was a tongue twister. But yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Smack that like button down below if you did. And leave a comment of what other types of videos you guys just would like to see. I'm thinking of doing some other Minecraft videos. You know, I have a dragon now. And I'm thinking I might be able to do some cool challenges. So I hope you guys enjoy. Subscribe if you're new. I'm trying to get to 120 subs before this year is over. Peace out. Feels a year away Like the seconds, the beginning and the end uh -huh. But if in time it's yesterday Your picture's gonna bring it home to me again The world is waiting up The world is waiting half a step beyond our door